Since launching Triveovation, our all-in-one testimonial plugin, about a month ago, we've been listening to your feedback and comments, and in this video, I'm very pleased to show you the new features that we've added to the plugin. Hi, I'm Hanne from Thrive Teams, and the first thing that I want to show you is the testimonial capture page, because that is where we added most of the new features. Let's take a look. Here we're looking at a new page where we want to add a testimonial capture form. Just drag it onto the page, let's click on it, choose the default capture page, and go to the form settings. Here you can see that we added something new in the questions that's called an add placeholder text. Adding a placeholder will help you to prompt your visitors to start their testimonial. Let me give you an example. The way we use it on the testimonial capture page for Thrive Ovation is we ask our visitors how they gather testimonials before using Ovation. And as a placeholder text, we use the phrase before using Thrive Ovation I dot dot dot. This will help the visitor to start their testimonial and will make it less intimidating. It will help you get better testimonials and more of them because it's just easier to fill out. The next feature we've added is the possibility to not ask for a picture on the testimonial capture form. If this is something you would like to do, simply click on the switch and now the image field won't be displayed anymore. Next, let's take a look what happens when somebody submits a testimonial. In the previous version of Ovation, you could just show a success message, but now we'd also added the possibility to redirect to a URL. Click on the drop-down menu, select redirect to URL and paste your URL here. This will allow you to send people to a testimonial thank you page where you can add a little video to thank them or you could even give them a gift like a free ebook for example. Now let's save this and take a look at how the capture form looks without the image field and with the placeholder. As you can see on this capture form there is no image field anymore and we have the placeholder text in the field that will disappear as soon as somebody starts typing. When we click on the submit button, we'll go to the thank you page. Now those were the features that we've added to the capture form, but there is one more thing that I want to show you in the settings of the plugin. When you go to the Thrive Ovation dashboard and go to settings, you can see that in the placeholder image, you now have the possibility to upload your own image. This will allow you to change the default image that's normally shown on a testimonial with no picture. Click on new image, Select an image from your media library and save the settings. Now, when we look at the testimonials, we can see that the default gray image has been replaced with the image I just chose in the settings. These are the four new features we've added to the latest release of Thrive Ovation. I hope you like this and if you have any comments or questions, you can leave them below.